well that didn't last. <laughs> the sticky part of that tray isn't sticking to the high chair, so she spilt like majority of her breakfast all over herself. Good morning. Bailey has some oatmeal and some orange juice. Are you going to eat your eggs? You woke up on the wrong side of the bed, huh? <laughs> I know. Let me do your favorite. Want to take a bite? She's still pretty congested, so I don't know if food is like super appealing to her right now. She won't eat even like those pouches either. Let me drink some water. Mmm. Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. I am trying to get ready for the day really quickly while Adam is downstairs watching both of the girls. Usually on the weekends is when we like to switch off on who gets to sleep in, and Saturdays is usually my day, and on Sunday I let Adam sleep in, but I felt bad because the girls are pretty loud this morning, and so he woke up a little bit earlier than he planned on. But like I said, I'm trying to get ready for the day and pick out my outfit, but I got a really fun package in the mail yesterday, so I wanted to share that with you guys. So I got this package from ThreadUp, and thanks to ThreadUp for sponsoring this portion of today's vlog. But if you guys have never heard of ThreadUp, it's an online thrift store. So they sell a bunch of different brands for over 90% off the retail price, which is amazing. And I found some really cute stuff, you guys. Like, I had no idea that this site even existed, so I'm so glad they reached out to me to partner with me on today's video because I found some really cute things and I'm really excited to share them with you guys. But how cute is their packaging? They have like little polka dots on them and then the tissue paper is cute too. Um, so I'm going to take everything out and show you guys everything that I got. So these are all the pieces that I chose and I'll try them on in a second, but I think it's so rad to shop secondhand because you're not only giving these clothes new life and making someone else's day, but it also helps the environment tremendously, which is one of my favorite things about ThreadUp. Okay, the first thing that I want to share with you guys is probably my favorite thing that I got. Um, it's this black cardigan and it's by the brand Drew and it was originally $238 but you guys I got it for $39.99 so they have amazing deals on their site and I'm obsessed with it. So it's just a black cardigan and then it has like a suede material right here and this is such a good staple to have in your closet. You could dress it up or down, but it fits perfectly and I'm super excited about this piece. I can't wait to wear it this season and next season because it's still really cold in California. Right now, I don't know what's going on with the weather, but I'm obsessed with this cardigan. It's so cute. The next piece that I wanna share with you guys is this really pretty like wine colored cardigan. It is so soft. As soon as I pulled this out of the package last night, I put it on and I haven't taken it off since. This is probably what I will be end up wearing today, either this or the black cardigan. But I love the bell sleeves on it. And this is from the brand New Look and it was originally $37 and I got it for $12.99. This is the next sweater that I got. I was like drawn to sweaters. I don't know why, probably because it's still really cold here. But this is from the company Erie and Allie and it was originally $143 and I got it for $25.99. And I think it's so cute. You could honestly transition this into spring too and just wear it with like jean shorts or something. But how cute is this? I love the scallop trimming on it on both sides. I think this is so cute. So I'm really happy with everything that I got. I also just want to share with you guys really quick how easy it is to use their site too. So they also have an app. It's just called ThreadUp. And once you click on the app, this is what the home page looks like. So I'm just going to go down to the search tool at the bottom. And I was previously searching for free people. So um, everything free people came up. But you can search any brand that you're looking for, whether that's free people, anthropology, um, Target, Forever 21. They have everything. And you can refine your search and filter it too. So you can filter it by size or if you're searching for tops or sweaters or pants or color wise you can also filter it that way too so it's super easy to use. 
So I was super excited to work with ThreadUp and share with you guys too because I'm obviously not ignorant to the fact that not everyone can shop and afford designer high-end pieces, but ThreadUp gives you the opportunity to at a way, way cheaper price point. So I hope you guys are excited as I am to shop and find deals through ThreadUp and they give you guys a special discount code of 30% off your first order so you can click the link in the description box and use my code Tara30. There you go. There you go. Here, let's put your pants on. These pants on. The other ones. These ones. Whoops. Not those ones. What color are these? Blue. Blue. Where's yours? What? Where's yours? What? Where's yours? Your shorts are blue? Where's what? Are you Papa Piggy? <laughs> Give me a kiss. You gotta go do your hair. Crazy. Crazy hair. <laughs> you like your outfit today? <laughs> Should we go get your sister dressed? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Hi, sweet girl. <laughs> Did you wake up a little happier this time? You were grumpy this morning. We gotta pick you out an outfit. Oh, Bailey's already on it. Um, I think that's a little too small for her. And it's a little cooler outside today, so maybe something a little bit warmer. Maybe pick her out a sweater. Uh, it's a sweater. Which one? Right here. The Mickey Mouse one? Oh, this one? Okay, that'll work. Do you have a good nap? You it's slept for a long time. Ooh. Wow. I don't sleep with this. In this in my Careful. house. Can you get me a diaper? Yep. Yep. Yeah. Thank you. What the So sweet. I love you. So we are headed to Best Buy right now because we are buying a new vlogging camera. I'm so excited. We're getting the G7X. Yeah, G7X. And we already bought it online. We are just needing to go pick it up. So that's what we're gonna do right now. This is the one that we're using. It's by Canon. It's the M5 and I love it. The quality is amazing, but as you can see, it's like massive. It looks like a machine gun. So it's really awkward vlogging in public with this thing. And you have to have an external mic too, which is kind of annoying. So everyone recommended the G7X, so I'm super excited. Um, and it's like way more compact. So we'll see how it works. <laughs> Of course, as soon as we pull in to Best Buy, she falls asleep. Oh, that would happen. What do you think, Dad? <laughs> I love her. She'll never sleep ever, except for in the car. Make sure you get the right one. I already paid for it. Oh, ooh, it's so pretty. It's so little, oh my gosh. Selfie cam. I like how the screen flips up too instead of down. The M5, what I'm vlogging on right now, the screen flips down. So if you have a tripod on it and you're holding it, you can't view the viewfinder, which sucks. Oh, oh my it gosh, is a it's different so battery. So little. Let me hold it. It's sad. I think it's a different battery. It's so cute. I love it. Cute. It's cute. <laughs> it's cute. Let's see if I can get it in the first try. Woohoo! First try. Pro vlogger. Yeah, hey, I need the card. First clip with our new vlogging camera. What do you guys think? Can you tell any different? It's so small. I feel like I'm carrying a little toy. 
The battery is not charged on this thing, obviously, so we're probably gonna have to still use the M5. Um, we're on our way to, where are we going, babe? Chipotle. Chipotle. Wouldn't be a Sunday without stopping by the barber shop for Adam to get his hair cut. Yeah, let's go. Bailey's gonna go with him. So while Adam and Bailey are inside getting his hair cut, I thought I would just update you guys while I'm just sitting here in the car waiting for them about what's been going on with the girls and the whole sleep situation and stuff because I've mentioned this to you guys a couple times that Shay wakes up so early and it's been that way for a couple months now and so I just come to accept the fact that she's an early riser. She wakes up at like 6, 6.30 and it's really exhausting especially um, because I'm up super late to like 1 or 2 in the morning working on editing the vlogs for you guys. So I get maybe like 3 or 4 hours of sleep every night and it's just, it's just taking a toll on me physically, emotionally, mentally. I just feel so drained and I'm like, okay, something needs to change. So what I decided I was going to do is just push back the bedtime because they go to sleep anywhere between 6 30 7 o'clock because they're just so tired by that point Bailey doesn't nap during the day at all anymore um, it's very rare when she does and um, Shay wakes up from her last nap at around 3 3 30 sometimes 4 o'clock so she's like ready for bed by 6 30 or 7 but I'm gonna try and push it back tonight to like 8 o'clock and see how they do and see if they sleep in a little bit later I'm really hoping they do and that this works because it's just it's a lot and I know there's a lot of you out there that have like it way worse than I do that your babies wake up at like 5 30 6 o'clock and I just I don't know how you guys do it so I'm hopeful that this is gonna work I'm also gonna get one of those alarm clocks that like turn green when you can get out of your bed in the morning for Bailey because she's starting to wake up really early too now because she notices that the Sun is up and she's like mama the Sun's up it's time to wake up and I just hear her whining next to her door she doesn't leave her room which is nice but she'll just sit by her door and whine for me to come get her because she thinks it's time to wake up at like 6 37 she's been doing that for the past week now which I mean I guess is fine because that's when Shay wakes up so it's not a big deal but I really want to try and fix that so hopefully I don't know tonight we can push the bedtime back till 8 and we'll see if they end up sleeping in a little bit later that hair though yeah Look at that fade, babe. Best eight dollars ever spent, you know? <laughs> finished filming a cleaning video that will be going up on my channel on Wednesday I think and Adam took both of the girls down to the park so that I could film which was really nice of him and he took the other camera so I think he's vlogging while um, I filmed so we'll see the footage that he got but this whole daylight saving thing is totally throwing me for a loop and I'm so exhausted it feels way later than it really is and I cannot wait for bedtime, you guys. I'm like counting down the minutes until I can get my ass in bed. Did you bite your tongue? Yeah. Let me kiss it. Let me kiss it. <laughs> Sick. All right, let's go. Daddy, daddy, daddy. I did you. Yeehaw. He's a cowboy. <laughs> Wee. <laughs> Is it fun? Yeah, it was so fun. Wow, you're so strong. Touch your toes with the bar. Use your abs, your baby abs. Good job. Good job, honey. 
High five. Bailey, high five. Fist bump. <laughs> that was weak. Come on, one more. One more fist bump. <laughs> so, left my phone at the, uh, at my house. So, we were out here for like an hour. It's getting cold. Hi, Shay. Is it getting cold out here? So we're gonna go home and see Mama and eat some food. Yeah. Bailey's running out of gas here, so I gotta push her with the stroller. Hey, whatever works, I guess. Shay, is that fun? We just got home from the park, and Bailey is extremely tired. We gotta feed them dinner, and then they're going to bed. Did you have fun at the park, babe? <laughs> oh, are you sad? We gotta get you some dinner, honey. This daylight saving time is throwing you off, huh? <laughs> Me too. Oh. Good night, sweet girl. I love you. Okay guys, that's gonna be it for today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to give it a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to check out the links in the description box and check out Thread Up and let me know if you guys score any cute finds. I'd love to hear. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.